Nothing beats the thrill of a day out fishing, and what better way to cap it off than with a delicious prawn feast. With so many prime locations along the Sunshine Coast, the chances of reeling in a great catch are endless. Over the past month, the waters have been abundant with prawns and various fish species, making now the perfect time to hit the water and take advantage of this amazing fishing season. Prawning is not just for seasoned anglers, it's an activity that can be enjoyed by everyone, young and old alike. Whether it's a fun weekend outing or a family holiday adventure, prawning is accessible and rewarding for all. The key to success. Look for boats already fishing for prawns, where there's a boat, there's a prawn. All you need is a net, enthusiasm, and some good luck. The best prawning season on the Sunshine Coast typically runs from February to the end of May, but always keep an eye on the weather. The secret to good prawning is understanding how the rain, tides, and salinity all play a role. Creeks and rivers especially benefit from heavy rainfall, creating the perfect habitat for prawns and crayfish. They thrive in the estuaries where the fresh water mixes with the salt water, making for ideal fishing conditions. If you're targeting crayfish, remember that they are nocturnal creatures. They're most active after the sun sets or just before dawn, depending on the moon phase and the tide. Old-time anglers swear by fishing around the new moon after rainfall, this is when crayfish are more likely to be out and about, gathering in the deep holes during the low tide. To maximize your chances, try fishing on the outgoing tide in creeks, rivers, or when the tide changes in open waters. If you're fishing from land, head to piers, bridges, or any structure with lights, as the glowing red eyes of the prawns are easily spotted in the dark. A flashlight can also help spot them in the water at night. While you might see them near the surface, the real jackpot lies in deeper waters. For boaters, using a sounder can dramatically increase your chances. Shrimp often appear as small, scattered dots, creating a cloud-like pattern on the screen. Once you find the sweet spot, your screen will be flooded with signals, this is when you know you're in prawn heaven. A quality cast net is your best ally for catching shrimp. A top pocket cast net allows prawns to swim right into it, making it easier to drop them into your bucket. But remember, casting a net takes practice, and timing is everything. The quicker you can cast after spotting prawns, the better your chances of a full catch. Once you've caught your prawns, it's time to keep them fresh. If you're not eating them right away, dip them in a mix of salt water and ice to preserve their freshness. You can freeze them in water-filled containers for future meals. While prawning can be a rewarding experience, it's important to be mindful of your tools and methods. Commercial fishing is a completely different ball game, highly demanding and requiring a great deal of skill and experience. But don't worry, Recreational fishing offers just as much fun and thrill, especially if you've got the right tools and know-how. Cast nets are popular for catching prawns. These circular nets with weighted edges allow the net to spread out and sink to the target species. While cast nets can range in size, the best one for you is the one you can throw most effectively. It's all about skill and practice, so take your time and get familiar with your net before heading out to catch prawns. Other tools like sun nets and dip nets are also great alternatives. These traditional methods, although not as commonly used today, offer unique ways to fish for prawns, especially when you're targeting shallow waters or areas with strong currents. Prawn traps are another useful tool. These small mesh traps are easy to set and perfect for catching prawns that might not be active on the surface. They're great for anyone who wants to fish without being on the water all the time, but remember to follow local regulations regarding their use. Fishing for prawns isn't just about the catch, it's about understanding the conditions. Water clarity, salinity, and tide schedules all play a critical role in determining your success. Prawns are migratory creatures and are often found in shallow waters during specific seasons. If you want to increase your chances, it's essential to monitor the tides and weather. It's also worth mentioning that prawns are sensitive to light. If you're fishing during the day, cloudy conditions are your best friend. At night, using blue lights can help attract them to your nets, making them easier to spot. 
So, whether you're fishing at night, experimenting with different tools, or scouting the best prawning locations, remember that the key to success is patience and preparation. And of course, always make sure you stay safe on the water. The Sunshine Coast offers incredible prawning opportunities. With the right knowledge, tools, and a bit of luck, you can enjoy a fantastic day out on the water and bring home a big catch. So pack your nets, head to one of the many pristine waterways, and with a little bit of skill and enthusiasm, you could be enjoying the freshest prawns around. With everything shared so far, you're now equipped with the basics and tips to have a successful prawning adventure. However, to increase your chances of catching delicious and large prawns, it's crucial to combine all these elements together. One important factor that many anglers overlook is timing. While you can go prawning all day long, choosing the right time will significantly increase your chances of catching more prawns. Specifically, when the tides are high or low, prawns tend to move more actively, making it a more effective time for fishing. Pay attention to the tide schedules and plan your trip accordingly. The time of day is also crucial. Prawns are typically more active at night or during the early morning, especially on days with a new moon or cloudy conditions. These are the days when the light from the pier or dock lamps will attract prawns closer to shore, making it easier for you to spot and catch them. When prawning, don't forget to bring your safety gear. Especially on nighttime fishing trips, when visibility is limited, it's important to have safety equipment ready. Make sure you have a life jacket, a flashlight, and protective gear like gloves and slip-resistant shoes to stay safe. Moreover, choosing the right location is key. Shallow areas, where water flows strongly or near piers and docks, are ideal spots for prawning. However, be mindful of the water flow and salinity levels to find the best spots. Additionally, setting prawn traps is an efficient way to catch prawns without constantly being on the water. These traps can be set in areas where prawns frequently pass by, and you can check them after some time to collect your catch. Once you're familiar with the basic tools and methods, you can try a few tricks to increase your chances of catching more prawns. One of the most effective ways is using specialized baits like fresh fish, squid, or even commercially made prawn pellets. Try changing your fishing location and times of day to find areas with higher concentrations of prawns. Experimenting will help you better understand prawn behavior and the ideal conditions for catching them. Remember, prawns are migratory creatures and will change locations based on the season and weather, so keeping an eye on your surroundings is always important. In addition, tools like fish finders or sonar devices can help you pinpoint prawns under the water, maximizing your chances and making your fishing trips more productive. Don't hesitate to share your experiences with other anglers. Exchanging information about good prawn fishing spots, techniques, or the best times to fish will help you learn even more. You can also join online forums and fishing communities to stay updated with tips and tricks from other fishing enthusiasts. The success stories of other fishermen will be an inspiration to help you improve your prawning skills. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced angler, continuous learning and improvement will lead to great rewards. Prawning is a fun and rewarding outdoor activity that not only allows you to relax but also gives you the chance to enjoy fresh, delicious prawns. With the advice and tips we've shared, we hope you have an enjoyable and successful prawning experience. Embrace the natural atmosphere and the excitement of catching fresh prawns from the waters. We wish you amazing prawning adventures and a cooler full of great catches. Always remember to stay safe on the water and follow the environmental protection regulations when prawning.